to me, I, and I said in my book, um, business is the ultimate sport. You compete 24 by seven by 365. And people are always like, well, why don't you just chill? You know, like I love to compete. You know, I love to know that, you know, all these millennials, oh, you're good, watch this, you know? <laughs> you know, I, I still go out there, I've had two hip replacements. I, I was playing basketball yesterday against guys half my age, right? I don't give a shit, right? It's just like, you gotta go. My hero is me at 35. So you see, every day, every week, every month, and every year of my life, my hero's always 10 years away. I'm never gonna be my hero. I'm not gonna attain that, I know I'm not. And that's just fine with me, because that keeps me with somebody to keep on chasing. So to any of us, whatever those things are, whatever it is we look up to, whatever it is we look forward to, and whoever it is we're chasing, to that I say amen. To that I say all right, all right, all right. Making The Revenant was about man's relationship to the natural world, a world that we collectively felt in 2015 as the hottest year in recorded history. Our production needed to move to the southern tip of this planet just to be able to find snow. Climate change is real. It is happening right now. It is the most urgent threat facing our entire species, and, and we need to work collectively together and stop procrastinating. I don't fuck with nobody. Yeah, I don't fuck with nobody, like at all, nobody. So it's very simple. I, I stay at my house, and it's just me, my homies, my fiance, my, my little puppy I just got, and I don't fuck with nobody. I don't go anywhere. I don't go to parties. I barely go outside, like literally. I really don't go outside that much just because I don't, I don't fuck with nobody. I know that seems a little weird, but I, I refuse to allow any sort of cancer in my life to spread. So I just stay as positive as I can. Every moment matters. And it makes me think about my mom. Every moment with her matters. It makes me think about my friends that have passed away. And those moments matter because when they're gone, they're gone forever. So you better f you better just give 100% the love, what you're doing, where you're at.